It's not a bird or a plane, but a drone hovering over Thompson's football practices. A local company called Drone Tech found a new way to film the X's and O's on the field. The problem we always had were batteries. The batteries itself would not last long. So we would have to land it and they would last about 20, 25 minutes. Michael Golden and his team had to find a fix to keep the drones in the air for continuous 4K footage for a full practice. Now we would miss shots and so we decided, well, let's build a tether drone that can stay up for, you know, um, three to four hours and um, and it would it would go through the full length of the game without having to change it out so we, we wouldn't miss any shots at all. The drones are able to produce live streams and Facebook lives which will give fans a new option to watch the games during the season. We are um, developing sanitation drones um, to sanitize the, the, the sidelines and to the, the stadiums in general. The sanitation drones are still in the works and should be done before the start of the fall high school season. Ryan Hennessy, WVTM 13. You can track the coronavirus uh, right on your smartphone with the WVTM.